Hi, everybody. First of all, I just want to say happy holidays to everybody. And we are live. And the reason for this live, guys, is because China, brother and sister, are now in the house. And you can see we got Ronnie eating up all the snacks. But right now, China is uh, over there getting her something to eat. Running, getting dog food, and we got a new surprise for you guys. I mean, I'm sorry. We got a new surprise for you guys. We have brought the puppies in, guys, and uh, we did originally have like 17, 18 puppies. We gave all of them away except two. And uh, we got two beautiful little puppies behind this chair, which I'm trying to grab, but right now, until they come out, I'm going to show you pretty much a basic synopsis of what's going on in the house. We put up the Christmas tree, guys. We did. And China, she's trying to get Ronnie's uh, popcorn, which is my damn popcorn. Excuse me, guys. That's why we marked this video not for kids, because, you know, sometimes adults, you know, we could be filming, and I thought it would be safe for me to just go ahead and say uh, uh, this video is not for kids today, because <laughs> we have Ronnie, who always cussing. But anyway, um, basically, China, she's in the house. You guys see China has grown up a little bit. She is now uh, four months, going on five months now. And her brothers and sisters are in the house, guys, and they're behind the chair. So I'm trying to wait until they come out. So, um, but yeah, her brothers and sisters now are, can you believe it, four weeks old, about to be five weeks next Monday. Um, the mother dog is, uh, wow, is getting ready to go. Um, she's going to find her, the, the uh, dog pound is going to find her a new home tomorrow. And right now, I'm going to basically put the uh, laptop on the floor. You guys hear the news in the background and just wait till the little puppies come out so you guys can see China with the puppies. So, here we go. Yeah. Okay. China's over there looking for a brother and sister's name. Yeah, I'm just going to All students are getting the education that they need. Right now, it's feeding time for the puppies. North Carolina's first of all, I got to get China's food. She's going to have to get some I don't know, guys, there under the chair. And, uh, basically, I'm trying to see if they're going to come out, but right until they do, I'm just going to keep the camera rolling. China's always in her food. She got her own food. I don't know why she's trying to take their food, but. You just protect your sister. I don't know, guys. I guess I'm going to put the laptop somewhere where you guys can see them when they come out. They come out in a few minutes. But China, she's always on the go trying to find them. They're, they're everywhere. Just two little puppies. One's a girl and one's a boy. We just kept two for ourselves. Well, I did. I kept two for myself. And plus China. Couldn't take care of 18 dogs, guys. So, you know, we had to downsize. But right now, um, they're about four, like I said, four weeks going on five. Talent now is uh, five months just about, and they're behind the chair, guys, so I had to, you know, pull the furniture away from the walls because, you know, how little puppies, they're in everything. You want to make sure they're not, you know, pooping all over the place and, you know, trying to make sure they can get used to the home. You see China, she's pretty much thinks she's mom when she's just big sister. Her mom is outside, so... I don't know, guys. I guess we're just going to see them and wait till they come out. But in the meantime, I'm just going to sit in here, guys. You can see China, the Christmas tree. Give me something. You guys, something to look at because I have homework to do, but I want you guys to see the puppies. So I'm just going to leave it there. You guys can see Ronnie and China do their little thing. Oh, I guess I'll just put it here. Come on, China. Break down neighborhood by neighborhood. Who sees the risk of a rich break? And the 
area and people are calling it a miracle. So I just think this is just so amazing for our community. The park special impact and how the diversity and inclusiveness. <coughs> Well, guys, you know what? Right. We'll just have to wait until they pop up behind the chair, guys. And when you see them, they'll be right behind the mirror. They make a little, that little cameo scene about every 10, 15 minutes. If I go looking for them, they won't come out. So basically, I'm just going to keep the laptop going for like 10, 15 minutes and hope we get to see them. If not, then we'll be looking at China. China, we can't get the puppies to come out. We had to put this uh, green blanket on the couch so that the dogs wouldn't be scratching up the furniture, guys. So I don't know. Don't look like they're going to come out, guys. So I'll try to stay as long as I can. I don't want to bore you with uh, no good content for YouTube today. So. But I did put up the Christmas tree. I did, guys. I really didn't feel like doing Christmas, and I'm still just messing with it. But, you know, I just put up the Christmas tree. My daughters, they're grown, doing their own thing. But I got my little grandkids, and, you know, they're with my oldest daughter. But I said, well, might as well just put up a Christmas tree, even though I'll be in Washington, D.C., you know, with my family. Uh, but, um... This year has been truly a great year. It really has. Wow. I've had one puppy, two, three, four, uh, nine, 18. <laughs> had to downsize to three. And it's been great, you know. But being retired from the military, going to school full time. Wow. I could, you know, at least try to keep some of them. But I thought maybe that, you know, if I share the love to everybody else that needed puppies and you know it was it's been great for me you know besides my workload and it's been busy guys really i have i really haven't been live streaming as much as i normally would i guess the last time i really major made i mean really got into live streaming was about around november and i said well i showed you a couple of you guys a couple of streams of when the puppies first born and the mom and you know it's been a whole good month now and uh <laughs> It's almost Christmas now, so I said, well, let me uh show you guys China interacting with the little puppies. And they've been busy all day, so hopefully she'll pop her head when one of the little puppies will pop their head on the chair. China's now going back there, guys, so I don't know if I should keep live streaming or go ahead and end the stream, which I'll probably go ahead and end the stream. And you know, once the puppies come out in the opening, you know, in the middle of the floor, whatever, and then you guys can get, you guys can see them. Um, basically the puppies, I don't know if you saw the previous live stream I did about two weeks ago, all the little puppies were mixed colors, black and white, white, uh, there was a brown one, brown and white one, some of the same colors, China, beautiful puppies, man. And when I had to, you know, get rid of them to, you know, give them another families or, you know, send them off or whatever, it really did make me feel sad. So, but I am lucky enough to have two puppies, one girl, one boy, and then China, the oldest sister. And then, of course, we still have the mom who's outside right now, but um, she's going to be leaving and be going to uh, a better place, you know, somebody to take care of her because um, <laughs> I had too many dogs, guys. And, you know, trying to my own. Plus, those two little puppies, I, I think that's pretty much, you know, 
enough for me to handle right there. And pretty much China, you know, she takes care of her old sisters and brothers. All I have to do is just, you know, make sure that, you know, they go outside and, you know, that they defecate whatever outside of nothing else. But today I wasn't so lucky because the boy, we haven't given him a name yet. You guys got to help me name these two puppies. They're so beautiful. I had to defecate and um, I had to uh, do a lot of cleaning in here. So that's why you see the chairs away from the walls. I've been putting down uh, pine saw and getting up because the last thing you want is the little puppies to have fecal matter in your house. Oh, my God. I think little puppies, uh, look about three and four weeks, are, their feces smell bad as the big dog. So it's all good. I'm trying to figure out. China! <laughs> Look at what she's doing. What time are you going to say anything? Guys, I want you guys to see the cute little puppies, but I guess it's going to be another day. If you see China now, you can see the two miniature little puppies. They look just like China. China has green eyes. One of them has green eyes. The other one has dark brown eyes. But um, guys, I have not named them yet, so if you guys can think of a good name between now and the next couple of days, it'd be great. Um. But like I said, I want you guys to see them, but they're probably going to sleep now because it is uh, 20 minutes to seven here. And uh, I'm trying to get them, guys. Y'all see, I'm still trying to do my Christmas decor, and I still got some Halloween decor I got to take out of here. But they're underneath the chair, and I can't get to them. I even had to take my machetes down, my military machetes, which are on the floor. Well, I've been trying to get to them, guys. You can see they're up under this chair. They must be sleeping, so. Uh, I guess we're going to. This is what China's looking for. <laughs> they are so far up under this couch that I can't get to them, so I'm just going to let them sleep. But I have noticed that they've been popping their heads out, and uh, the little female, she goes right to the to this mirror that you guys see. And you see China right now is trying to get to her brothers and sisters. You're like, where are they at? Where are they at? And she's been pacing the floor as if she's the mother. <laughs> what, China? So China wants me to move so she can have a chair because this is about their, their bedtime. China, she goes to sleep around 6.30 after she eats. So. And today, I just like China eat all she wants because she's been so busy. So I told you guys she wanted to lay down on the couch. So basically what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go ahead and let the laptop run on China. And maybe the puppies will come out. So um, I'm going to let the camera run probably about 10 minutes, guys. And like I said, I got this old little sheet up on the couch so China won't be scratching and jumping. Because last time China tried to get it on the couch, guys, and she jumped straight out the window and she only... Didn't go out the window, but she banged her head up because she thought the reflection in the window was another dog. <laughs> China is something else, guys. I'm telling you, this girl, she will have me laughing so much. So, China, are you going to introduce your brothers and sisters to um, your YouTube family? Are you? And guys, I'm not trying to get on the camera because I got my hair wrapped up with a silk scarf on and I'm pretty much in my nightgown and, and, and a pair of uh, sweatpants. So I don't want to be getting on the camera looking all jacked up, but I think it's pretty much nap time for the dogs, guys. And uh, the little puppies, they are so beautiful. Oh, my God. I wish you guys could see them. Earlier this morning when I got up, after I brought them in the house because this was getting down to like 25 degrees tonight, um, I brought them inside and uh, the mom, you know, she runs back and forth all the time. She, you know, pretty much like the mom dogs have their puppies, but after four or five weeks, she tried to wean off the, the little puppies, the puppies wean off the mom or whatever. So um she leaves about two or three hours and she comes back but so i just brought them in the house guys because it's supposed to get cold tonight and speaking of weather check it out and it's 48 now guys this was a drop down to like 26 tonight and yesterday it was 75 degrees my grandmother calls this stuff pneumonia weather because your pores be open and you get sick. My mother and my sister, man, they are sick. Already sick with the flu. I have, I have a cold. I've been sick for the last couple of days. But look here, guys, 27 degrees in the morning. 
And we're supposed to get snow Friday and Saturday. And Monday, I'm looking at rain. But anyway, guys, I'm not going to stay on here long because you can see that. Oh, did I just see a little puppy? I think I did, guys. Hold on. Oh, she went back under the couch, guys. Oh, well, guys, I really basically tried to get the puppies so you guys could see them, but it's a uh, quiet time. So I'm going to tone down the lights. Oh, and maybe they might come in. Right. Leave the Christmas tree on. And basically, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm just going to leave the laptop right here. I'm going to leave it on time. How about that? And hopefully. Sean, do you think your brother and sister could come up on the chair? I don't think so, guys. So maybe we should try this again tomorrow, you know? But anyway. These guys can see China's knocked out, so. Her brothers and sisters are knocked out too. I try to get try to get the, the boy puppy this morning under the couch and he was just so mad. He was just just hollering all kinds of stuff. And then um I realized that you know um he doesn't drink milk anymore. He likes milk, don't get me wrong, his mom's breast and milk from the uh from the refrigerator, or whatever, but I put down a little small amount of dog food. Honey, don't you know that dog tore up all that dog food by yourself and he had a good poop on my floor? I was like, oh, my God, I didn't know that puppies at four weeks old can eat dog food. So basically what I did, I went to the store. I got me some uh, dog food, and I put a little bit of a, a mixed half-based water and a little bit of milk, and I mixed it all together. And I put a little bit of oatmeal in it um, that you normally give a baby. And, boy, they had a good time. They ate, and I sent them outside and let them play outside in the sun today. They had a blast. And then the temperature started dropping, and I brought them in the house. But I don't want to talk too much, guys, because you can see it's downtime around here. Everybody goes to sleep early. Uh, the boyfriend, he got off work. Now he's going to bed, getting ready for wrestling. And as for me, um, I have a test tonight, 8 o'clock. Oh, yeah, by the way, I made AA on my semester. I'm so happy with Fred University, guys. But I'm telling you, the work has been relentless. I had seven classes this semester. And I'm so glad the next semester I'm going to have three. So I have more time to do a live streaming. A whole lot more time to spend with my family and a whole lot more time to spend with Tanya and her brothers and sisters. So, guys, I guess I'm going to say, um, hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving, first of all. I didn't go live Thanksgiving. I'm so sorry, guys. My schedule was so hectic that I didn't even enjoy the Thanksgiving that I wanted. So, I had the chance to go to my parents' house, eat, and then as soon as I was done, a couple of drinks, and boom, back to homework classes, you know. A lot of times people think college right now that. You get off of the holidays. No, honey, you got to work hard. This is finals. You know, you got your finals exams and semesters and all this stuff going on. And, you know, if you're one of the people who don't, you know, are not good in school and you got to have that extra study time and tutors and all that. And yeah, I am a tutor. Um, man, it's just, it's just been very, very, uh, demanding so um i only do tutoring now just when you know somebody's in the class and some have whatever i try to you know give them you know the right chance or try to help them do the problems or whatever they're, they're going through but as far as being a full-time tutor oh god no i don't know how those tutors that get paid have all that time on their hands i guess you know maybe they don't have a, a career or they don't have a second job or have a home or whatever but you know, I guess you make the time. You want you're so passionate about something, you will make the time to do it. But me, man, my workload has been so hard. I'm just so glad that the semester is getting ready to end in the next six days, and then my classes going to go from seven down to three classes. Oh, guys, I cannot wait, and I can sit back and I can do my homework in the morning and have the rest of the evening to myself. Oh my God, ah, I thought I could take on seven, six, seven classes, guys. I can, but. It was very, very hard. So, like I said, I'm going to tone down my classes this semester coming up. It's going to be January 7th. It's about three classes, and then I have more time to do the things I like to do. Well, anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream. I hope you guys are having a happy hump day. And, guys, man, I am so sad to report that I heard that 
The Panthers are not going to the Super Bowl, which I kind of knew that, but we're not going to the playoffs, guys. We lost the fifth game this Sunday. Man, and uh, Cam Newton's not coming back to next season. We lost. Uh, our, our coach got fired. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Panthers is going through hell this this this, this football season, guys. I'm Wow. You guys got to start. Excuse me for my slurred speech. I am so tired. I'm pretty much... Uh, um, just pretty much just going off and drilling right now. When I should be sleeping like them, I've been up for the last ever since six, seven o'clock this morning, just doing homework, straight up homework. And I just got done about two hours ago, and then I have another test again at nine, eight, eight o'clock. Yeah, next hour and a half. So I'm gonna go ahead and um uh, end the stream. I hope you guys are having a happy Wednesday. And I hope that everything that you wish for or hope for to accomplish today that you have already done. If not, then I hope that, you know, if you didn't do it today, then always I hope you get it done tomorrow. Um, you know, time management is very essential. Um, whatever you're trying to seek or whatever your goals may be, I hope that you, you know. Oh, God, I was just looking at China. She's snoring, guys. First of all, I noticed her snoring. So I'm trying to tone it down a little bit. But, uh, you know, like I said, I hope that all your goals are achieved. And then you have a happy, happy, happy Wednesday. Um, as for tomorrow, guys, I don't know if I'm going to be in a live stream. I got a couple of e um, emails from some of my friends and subscribers who want me to live stream more about the dolls, guys. And like I stated before, you know, um, my schedule is, is very relentless. And hopefully by next Monday, I'll have a little bit more time to at least do one video a week or something as you can see the dolls grow. But... I try my best to show you uh, the little puppies which are behind this chair. <laughs> it's only two guys. It's not 18 anymore. All those other puppies are gone. It's a great home. And uh, I have China and two little puppies that look like it. One is a male and one is a female. So, guys, you can think of a name uh, for these beautiful dogs. I would love, love that you guys do that for me. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the stream. And I hope that you guys are having a beautiful day. So, um, I guess maybe what I'm going to do with the next 30 minutes or so is try to check out some of you guys' channels, um, see who's going live and just say hi, because I know some of my friends are like, girl, where have you been? <laughs> and I'm like, school, they were like, school, yes. But anyway, guys, as you guys see, it's trying to sleep, and um, I guess I'm going to see a couple of channels, and I'm going to do the same thing, so happy holidays, guys. I was waiting to see if China's gonna say anything. She's just gonna stretch. <laughs> well, anyway, guys. China, are you gonna say anything? I guess not, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream. And hopefully, if not tomorrow, maybe sometime this week, you'll get a chance to see the beautiful puppies. Until then, happy holidays. <laughs>